Yeah, hi guys. So welcome to the next part of functions here. So this uh, uh, question of function is actually combined with inequalities. It's a good question, a uh, bit lengthy also, but a very good concept. Combined with inequalities, AMGM. So we have studied this in uh, inequalities. If you have not studied, please uh, you can watch inequalities video and then you can come back to this. Okay. So let's see this question here. This question says that what is the minimum value of the function f of x y z? Okay. Is equal to x y y x by y plus under root y by z plus q root of z by x, where x y z are positive real numbers. So I've told you multiple times, right? Basically, when once you see this value, something minimum maximum here, and here we have got positive real numbers. So positive real numbers minimum maximum you can always relate to a m g m and h m. So for all the positive real numbers, the arithmetic mean is greater than equal to the geometric mean is greater than equal to the harmonic mean actually. Now, so once we once we once we we are trying to find this, okay, what we can apply up among AM, GM, and HM. So obviously, I'll be applying AM, right? Because AM means addition. So AM means addition, and here I'll be adding all these values. So AM is required. Now, between GM and HM, I should always apply here GM because in GM these three terms will get multiplied, and somehow if we if we manipulate it, right? So I can cancel Y and Y. I can cancel Z and Z something like that, right? But you need to basically manipulate a bit. So I I see that applying A M G M will be a good funda here. Okay. So if if I applying A M G M will be a good funda here, right? So basically, now, but in G M I want all these terms to get cancelled actually. Okay. So now see guys, uh, these terms will be cancelled when when we have x by y and into y by z, into z by x, right? So basically. For root y by z to become y by z, I need to for root y by z to become y by z, I need to multiply root y by z two times. That becomes y by z. And similarly, for cube root of z by x to become z by x, I need to multiply it three times. So three times cube root of z by x, when multiplied, will actually give the value of what? Will actually give the value of z by x, right? This will be what? This will be z by x here. This will be y by z here. Okay. Basically, a raised to one by three into a raised to one by three into a raised to one by three will be equal to what a here. Correct. That's the basic funda. Okay. So once you're trying to apply the apply this funda here, so what you can see guys here. Okay. So let's see that now. So now I need to multiply it multiple times. Okay, uh, two times and three times here. So that basically I should break this as six terms. So my six terms over here will be x by y. Uh, under root y by z. So basically, after adding to those two terms, I should get half of root y by z. So my two terms will be half of root y by z. Ah, uh, again half of root y by z. Okay. So adding them will make root y by z same equation. Multiplying them will cancel y. Will will make it exactly y by z. That remove the root, right? So this does this 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 will do our job actually. Fine. Then three terms will be one by three cube root of uh, z by x and three three such terms, right? One by three cube root of z by x and one by three cube root of z by x. Correct, fine. Now, uh, if you're seeing these values, right? So basically, you can see here that this is x by y. Now, adding these two terms will make it root y by z. Adding these three terms will make it cube root of z by x, and multiplying them will remove the square and cube roots, right? So basically, this will do our job, right? So now this is my these are these are my six positive real numbers: one, two, three, four, five, and six. Correct. So now their a m should be equal to their g m, or greater than equal should be their g m, right? The a m should be greater than equal to their g m here, right? Okay. Now let me write this write these values, okay? What is their aim, guys? So their aim will be x by y plus half of root y by z plus half of root y by z plus ah uh, one by three cube root of z by x plus one by three cube root of z by x plus one by three cube root of z by x. Okay. Now this value, if I add it, right? So this will be basically this. These are six terms. So their a m will be this divided by six here, and this should be greater than equal to their g m. In g m, I should multiply all these terms, right? 
So if I multiply all these terms, you can see here. So x by y into half of root y by z into half of root y by z into 1 by 3 cube root of z by x into 1 by 3 cube root of z by x into 1 by 3 cube root of z by x. Right? So, and this should be the sixth root. Under sixth root. Okay. That's the MGM funder, right? Hana. So, for six numbers, A, B, C, D, their aim, aim is what? A plus B plus C plus D plus E plus F divided by 6 is greater than equal to the GM. What is the GM? A, B, C, D, E, F, sixth root. Correct? Now, if, if you look at his values now, okay, so basically adding, so now I can just reduce this equation, right? Okay, so basically adding these values, okay, so adding these values, this, if you observe this numerator, this numerator is nothing but this is f of x, y, z only, because if I add it back, it, it will become x by y plus root y by z plus q root of z by x. So I can write this whole numerator as what? f of x, y, z only. Okay, because adding them, adding these values will actually uh, lead to the same value. Adding these values, these values is all from here to here, right? Will actually give us x, f, x, y, z only. Divided by 6, or I can say greater than or equal to 6. This, let's put this 6 here actually. And 6th root of, okay. Now if I multiply it, right, so you can sense it now, that we'll have half, half, 1 by 3 outside, right? We'll have like, like this I can write here, 6th root of, okay, half into half into 1 by 3 into 1 by 3 into 1 by 3. And now x by y is here root y by z into root y by z becomes y by z and cube root of z by x so z by x into z by x uh, sorry z cube root of z by x so cube root of z by x z by x and z by x becomes exactly z by x z by x right so i can cancel it actually so once i cancel here take care so i'll get all the values once i cancel here so what values i'm getting here so 6 raised to 6 and now it becomes 1 by basically it becomes what 6 into, uh, now this will be a 2 raised to basically 1 by 2 is square and 1 by 3 cube. So I can write these values as uh, under root of, okay. So I can write here 2 raised to, uh, this is, this will become, if I put this 6, uh, I can also write 2 into 3, okay, now fine, yeah. So now I can write here 2 raised to uh, basically minus 2 and this should be 1 by 6. And again, uh, that should be uh, 3 raised to minus 3. So let me just break right. One more step here. Let me. If I jump one more step, then many people will not understand actually. Okay. So 2 raised to minus 2 and this will be like 3 raised to minus 3. I can write here. Okay. And this whole actually raised to 1 by 6. Correct, right? Okay. So now this actually will become what? Okay. This actually will become what? A 6 into... 2 raised to minus, minus 2 into this 1 by 6, right? Minus 1 by 3 and this will become 3 raised to minus 1 by 2. Okay. Now, this 6 is again 2 into, I can further solve it, right? It's 2 raised to 1, 3 raised to 1, 2 raised to minus 1 by 3 and 3 raised to minus 1 by 2. Okay. So now, actually, this will become, yeah, this will become like uh, 1 minus 1 by 3. This will become like 2 raised to or uh, 2 by 3 into 1 minus half into 3 raised to half. So what I got ultimately guys, I got that f of x, y, z. So ultimately, I got that f of x, y, z is greater than or equal to 2 raised to 2 by 3 into 3 raised to half. Okay. So since it is always greater than or equal to this value, therefore the minimum value Therefore, its minimum value will be equal to 2 raised to 2 by 3 into 3 raised to half. That should be the answer to this question, right? A superb question. Okay, very nice question, but the most basic fund of AMGM, right? That's how basically the questions are made, okay? So, most basic fund of AMGM, but a very nice question here, okay?